So can you tell me your name and your job role, please? Alex Cross, I'm head coach of the Football Centre of Excellence at Grantham College, linked with Harrowby United. We have 24 first years involved in this Centre of Excellence who train four days a week and play on a Wednesday afternoon. And some of them are playing under 21s as well. Um, what's the age range? Is it 16 or 18? At the moment, we, we are 16 to 18. Um, as we progress, we are going to be developing um, and putting a structure in place that brings us from right from under 13s right through to the first team at Harrowby United uh, and, and having a, a natural conveyor belt of players that, that progress right away from, from under 13s right the way through the football club uh, is our aim. Um, so what's the purpose of the course then as a whole? So in terms of um, the whole setup and the, the centre of excellence is mainly to produce players for the first team, um, enabling opportunities uh, for, for both local footballers but, but also players that, are, that have maybe dropped out of the professional game um, and that are looking to, to rebuild their career and, and try and push to get, to get back into where they want to be. Um, so what experience or qualifications would you need to be eligible to join the course? So in terms of footballing experience, um, we are wanting players that have played professional football, that have been involved in a professional academy or represented uh, their county representative team, under 18s team. Um, we also are looking at players that have been involved in local other academies that maybe haven't been picked up by professional clubs um, that, that want to get a that want to get a paid contract and continue their education. Um, so you speak about um, paid contracts. Yep. Uh, how many contracts are going to be offered at the start of the year? Yeah, so we're, we're looking at offering 12 contracts, two-year contracts uh, every year. So um, three years down the line, we should have uh, 24 players that are contracted to Harrowby United who will all be playing uh, either under 19s, under 21s or first team football. Um, at the football club. So why Grantham College and Harrowby United? What what do you think the draw is? To... So in terms of in terms of local football, local football has has slowly uh, begun to begun to die. We've we've recently lost the Grantham Saturday Football League, um, which has meant that that local football players are aren't as available as they used to be. So to be able to keep Harrowby United um, alive and kicking, they need to produce their own their own footballers basically. And and with this with the centre of excellence and with the higher education pathway in terms of the paid contracts, uh, we expect that that we're going to have players that that want to progress um, into the paid contracts into the first team and and build a build a career for themselves in in football. Not only just not only playing football, but but all the all the um, everything that comes around being involved in in football. Um, so you've got your like your your analysis. You've got your physiotherapists, your conditioning coaches, your nutritionists, your psychologists, and giving them all op opportunities to have pathways into into various different different areas in the in the sport is is going to be vital for for not only Harrowby United but but the person and the individual himself. Um, so. How important is it to uh, keep us, you know, a smaller squad to work to work alongside? Yeah, with? so obviously the contracts we're 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 only offering twelve contracts per year, um, which would take us up to a maximum of of twenty four um, two years down the line. So we we want to keep keep it as tight knit as possible, um, give lots of opportunities, lots of footballing opportunities, but also lots of opportunities in terms of uh, challenging yourself in. And working with the centre of excellence players, um, working with some of the players in the younger age groups as well that will, that will slowly develop over the next couple of years. Uh, so, so to give them opportunities, not just football playing based, but opportunities around that as well is is pretty vital to to their learning. Um, so, how important is it to have education and football combined together? It, very important, it's particularly at a young age. Um, football's football's only a, a maximum of twenty year 
playing football is only a, a, only a 20 year career 